My name is Gondo247. I can say that I'm an artist here in the city of Houston, but I'm also a co-founder of Aerosol Warfare, a graffiti and street art gallery space, but then also a co-founder of the Graffiti and Street Art Museum, which that also rolls into producer of Humio Festival. I think, I think the best part of the festival, um, at any, any, I would say any year you ask me this, I'm going to probably say the best part of the festival is, is that sense of family reunion. A lot of these artists have never met each other. A lot of them have known each other 20 years. But when you bring them all to a new city and they all get to interact, it all becomes one big family. So then the next time someone's somewhere else, they might meet someone for the first time and they meet, run into that last person they just saw. And, you know, the, the graffiti and street art culture really is a big family. No matter where you go on the planet, you have that common connection. You might not even speak the same language, but someone will offer you, you can stay in my house because you do graffiti or you know, you're a street artist. And I love the camaraderie, especially here in Houston, to be able to bring in some international talent, national talent and big names per se. And then for them to be able to mix in with the local art, local community, and then give the local guys an opportunity to have you know, some one-on-one -on -one time with them and have an opportunity just to talk about things and just, just hang out. Um, that's what I love to see, because hopefully that inspires more things to happen. You know, this is our second annual, and, and we did the first year, and we said, oh wow, we learned so much doing this festival, like let's, we can make these changes and make this better this way, and, and then this year we applied all those changes, and now this year, you know, we see other challenges and other things that we can improve. We're like, oh, well now, now let's, so this thing's constantly evolving. I think, I think we, we have big ideas, but every year that we do something, that idea, it, it kind of starts getting honed in. Uh, but for sure, we, we really like the idea of this becoming more, the focus is the murals, but we really like the idea that there's more happening than just people painting. We want people to be working on walls, and, and if someone's coming to see that, which is great, that's what we wanted to do, well, while they're watching, what else is there? You know, what else can we do? Or that evening, or is there anything else that can involve the community so that it's more of a robust, robust festival? Although we, we're the organizing part of the festival, it isn't our festival, it's everyone's festival. Um, we can organize everything we want, but if it wasn't for the artists participating, it would just be us sitting, sitting in this room. The artists are a big part of it. On top of that, if it wasn't for the kind people that are sponsors and donors to the, to, to the, to the festival, then you know it, it's, 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 it's a community effort through partnerships and through uh, you know mutual support. Really cool things like this can happen.